Hey guys, it's Ryan Share here with Dex 3.10.0.2. It's the newest version of our top DJ mixing software that allows you to mix all types of media, including hosting karaoke. Uh, the newer versions, the last couple of updates, we've focused a lot on the karaoke specific functionality due to popular demand. Uh, mainly since we added the Party Time Karaoke subscription service, we've got a lot of new users uh, looking for these additional karaoke features, and we're very happy to bring a lot of them to you with these last couple of updates. Now, this particular video is going to cover the new Filler Music Player, uh, which is an automatic filler music player uh, that will play in between singers and sets automatically. Um, it'll fade on when you stop the karaoke player and... Uh, or rather, yeah, fade on when you stop the karaoke player and fade out when you begin playing a karaoke track again. Um, so what we've done, okay, you're probably already familiar with this. This is the little case player area right here of Dex 3. The case player is typically used to preview songs within your browser. So you can fast listen to a track without having to load it to a deck first, which is usually sent to the headphone cue channel. Well, we've added the ability to toggle that uh, case player to the filler music player uh, to automatically play in between singers and sets. So in order to set it to that mode, well, let's first put that back. In order to set it to the filler music player mode, you need to enter into Dex3's options. And you'll notice a new tab across the top as well here under preferences that's labeled karaoke. This is where you're going to find all the karaoke specific options for now. So under that karaoke tab, you're going to notice a couple new things, actually. You've got a new slider that shows you the total number of singers you display on screen, too, on the next singer screen, which shows up in between singers and sets or while the filler music player is playing. You can bring it all the way down to zero now and have no next singer screen, uh, all the way up to five. I usually leave it at three myself. That's just my personal preference. And, of course, under the same tab, we should tell you, too, we've relocated the option for placing an image or a video loop behind the next singer's display. Uh, so you'll find that option now here where you can select a video or, um, or, audio, or just an image to display behind the next singer screen automatically. So this is the option, though, we're concerned with right now. This is the new option to use the case preview player as background music filler player. So you're going to want to put a tick in this box to enable the automatic filler music player. So once you've done that, you can exit out. I've got a couple singers already placed in the new singer rotation list. As you can see, the mic button is toggled on, so I'm looking at the singer rotation list area. Uh, what I've got to do, though, of course, to have a filler music list queued up and ready to go to automatically play is we're going to toggle to the regular playlist for the side list. Right now I've got no songs in there. So what I'll do is I'll take one of my created user lists and I'll just send everything from the user list over to the side list as my filler music playlist. So we'll just right click in here and we'll choose send all to side list. So now it's going to populate with all the songs from here over to the side list. Now that's, that's done, I can exit by just clicking, well not exit, I can toggle back to the rotation list mode by clicking the mic icon. So now we're back looking at the rotation list. So now all I've got to do to start the filler music player is just hit play. You'll see it'll fade on and start playing. All I've got to do now is I'm ready to start hosting karaoke. I'll load my first singer. And then there's a quick fade out. As you can hear, it just stops. So say the karaoke track is now finished, let's just pretend it ended, you'll notice it'll fade back on, right where it left off. So what it does is it pauses the track where it's at, and then fades back in when you stop the track. So we'll show you again, let's move this singer up, load next singer. Now. Let me show you one other thing. So we'll stop this one more time, let it kick back on. And there's your filler music. What's nice about this, of course, is that it's not using one of the decks. So it frees up your decks in Dex 3 for whatever you want. I mean, you can have another audio track or video over here ready to go. And it's only using the one player for karaoke by just using Load Singer, which will load and play the song from rotation. So it's a really simple way to manage 
a karaoke night with the automated filler music player. So say I want to skip to the next track with the filler music player. I can right click on the play button. And it'll fade into the next track. What's nice about that, it's a nice smooth fade just like you would have with a normal auto mix. So, and of course, just clicking on the play button will pause it. So that's really all there is to it. So you right click to go to the next track, push play to start at the beginning of the night, and all you have to worry about is your singer rotation. If you've got any questions about the new filler music player, you know, and we've got additional karaoke specific features on the way as well, feel free to leave any questions or comments in the comment section below.